as we're on the road to losing weight, what other things can we do? What kind of foods can we eat that'll help us with this elimination process, right? We talked about in the previous video about drinking water and how important water was, but how can we have more liquids or more liquids and better quality stuff inside our food, inside our bodies? Well, I just grabbed the box of soup here. And uh, again, this is a lentil soup. And if you don't like lentil or bean soup, that's okay. But the important thing, and you'll see even on this box, it says low sodium. You know, a lot of soups today have a tremendous amount of sodium in them. I think this one has 20% uh, of, the, of the container of sodium, right? 490 milligrams. So that's quite a bit of sodium as an example. So as you're out there in the marketplace, you're trying to figure out, you know, what am I gonna serve my family for breakfast, for lunch, or for dinner? You know, be mindful of, you know, can you make your own soup? Then you have to deal with the whole idea of, am I gonna throw it away again? Or how long is it gonna take to make? But as you're out looking at substitutes and trying to segue from having those big meals, maybe just having some soup is the answer and having some soup with some bread or some crackers or something. As you're transitioning your body, again, we're trying to alter our routines, right, over the time. So soup to me is a good way to get there from here. And I can eat soup in the summertime. I can eat soup in the wintertime, spring, fall. It doesn't really matter what time of the year. I can always have soup. You can have soup for lunch. You can have soup for dinner. You can even have soup for breakfast. And again, this has some added fiber in there, some other benefits that you know, you're not gonna get out of having another meal. So as you're looking at replacing, again, replacing routines, replacing and making new habits, sort of looking at different, different things you can actually have that are in the marketplace today that you can eat rather readily that's quick to find. I mean, you can get this and bring this to your office. You can keep this in your, in your office drawer as an example, or wherever you're at at work. You could put this in a thermos if you're going to a specific location. You could heat this up before you even get there, put this in a thermos. So you can have a substitute that instead of having that other meal that you would normally have that would be bulking you up and filling you up and also still make you feel really good. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for sharing. Have some soup today. We'll talk soon. Take care.